and welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. My name is Sports Monkey, and welcome back to another episode of Franklinville. For today, we are obviously in City Skylines Sunset Harbor DLC, and we are back. And what we're going, going to do today is build some trains. Now, let me get out of this little scenic... Or I was using the scenic video as I learned how to do it last episode um what i do want to go through before i start building the trains we are going to have a little bit of a death wave over here in our city center accidentally when i was expanding the forest industry i cut off the power because remember our the last time you guys saw the forest industry kind of ended here and i expanded it out to here well i accidentally cut off the power for probably a minute in real time so a real you know a real life one minute and uh, there's a lot of crime, there's a lot of death and whatnot. But uh, that is why we're we are almost at 42,000, so we've basically recovered. So for today, I want to create a train system in our city. So I'm going to go over to the trains. Now, I don't feel, I want to put a train hub, so using the normal train station over here will not be our best case course of action but i am going to use a multiple a what is the exact name of it multiple platform end station okay so i'm going to use that and i'm going to put this on kind of like a busy avenue now i do want to give us some space to work with so i'm just gonna you know i'm just gonna put this at the very end so we need to figure out obviously where we are gonna put all of our other stations the actual normal train stations so if we go back over here, we do want a couple different passenger lines. And I do want one over here. So I'm going to put one right in this neighborhood. And then I do want to put one kind of over here. But I don't know how to exactly do it just yet. So let me get over here. Now this area over here is going to be our tourism slash leisure district eventually. Uh, once we get enough demand for that right now, we really don't have too much demand, but that might be for the next episode. So just letting you guys know a little sneak peek, we're going to be doing tourism and mo most likely, most likely tourism and uh, leisure. So that is something to look forward to. So let's see, what can we do over here? I don't know if this is going to be long enough, but we're going to attempt it. I just, I was eyeballing it. Ah, uh, and it's not long enough. Okay, that's all right. So what we're going to do, just to save some time, is delete this, delete this. What we're going to do, though, is keep that road over there so we can actually, there you go, so we can properly, there you go, so we'll put that over there. So we can properly kind of install the train lines and not have to worry about it. So we have two stations over here. Now we need to actually go into our suburbs. Now I feel like a good spot for our suburbs is actually going to be like right here. So it's kind of out of the way. I do know some of the neighbors are not going to be happy and we might have to change around. We might actually have to put in some commercial over here, but... We'll deal with that when the time comes. So my goal is to go into the mountain because the train going over this mountain is not very realistic. And I'm not even sure if I can actually pull that off. Then I also want to put one. Should I put one this way and, and then kind of loop it? Or, no, because then it's kind of stuck. All right, I'm going to try to put it here for the time being. And then we'll figure it out from there. So, so basically, if I put it over here, I don't want it... it uh, over there could be a better spot, but we will need to eventually get it back the train back over to the hub So we'll figure that one out, but I I'm okay with it right there So we have one two I kind of want to add one more and I kind of want to put it over here in this town now I'm bumping into something. I think that's the elder home or whatever it's called The elder care. Yes elder. I was close elder home elder care. We can just move this down the street I believe oh and we have a couple and then we have the child care center all right we'll put that right there and then our crematorium you can just move that down that's not a huge deal now what we have to remember sports monkey you have power lines that you need to actually replace and don't let half your population die by accident 
It wasn't half, but it was a good chunk of people. Legitimately, like, it was our city center when I, before, so, um, you know, while I'm connecting this power grid back up, please remember to hit that subscribe button if you like my content, and then smash that like button and comment. I do appreciate it. It does help the analytics of my Sports Monkey channel, and it helps get more views, so we can have more people can have more family members. Our, our little community is very much a family. I feel like the same, a lot of the same people keep commenting. And then there's also a lot of other YouTubers like um, It's Your Spawn. Uh, the Bubby, Sp Bubby Sports is in there. Um, you know, there's a lot. Master Vo is always in there. There's always also some content creators that are always in the comment section. So you guys get a shout out for that. I do appreciate it. You guys are all awesome. So we're all supporting each other. And if you don't know who I'm talking about, go into my channel uh, my channel profile, I guess, if you want to call it, or channel description, and you'll see links to those profiles. So check them out if you guys want. So we have a couple of train stations that we need to connect up, and we need to get it to the hub. So first things first, we will do the, the quite possibly the easiest connection of all of them. And we're going to go like this, and then we're going to curve it to the left. If we can. There you go. So that is probably the easiest connection that we'll have for the entire day. And then, and then we'll go from here. Nope, no, no. We want it to go the other way. Yeah, like that. Yes. No, 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 no. No, I want, okay, whatever. If I can, I can, I'm okay with that. Then I can strain the road and then connect it that way. That looks, that looks okay. That looks okay to me. Does, did the rail lines connect? Yes, that's perfect. Okay. So we have officially one railway <laughs> that's actually connected. So the next one, I am going to cheat and I am going to go underground. I mean, I don't know. Let me know in the comments section below, but is that like a bad thing? So now my goal is to kind of wrap. So we can't actually, do, well, we could, but it's not very likely that we can actually develop this beach area. I mean, it is very possible we could, but I just, you know, I feel like putting the train along there was actually a good idea. And in the comments section below, let me know if you think this is a good idea or not. And it's just hugging the coastline. So this is going to be a really nice train ride. And I know, I I know it's going to take forever to get there. But I feel like it'll, it'll, it'll be cool to have a train actually. Oh, can I curve this now? It would be cool to actually have a train on the coastline. I think that's my personal opinion. There we go, so we have that. So now I wanna go straight and I'm gonna park this right in, park it, yes, I'm parking the train track right in the train station. I mean, you're not really parking it, but. So now we have two connections and I kinda like that I kept this, I kinda like what I did, guys. I, I kinda like that, no, ooh, well, I will have to fl flatten it out later, but I do kinda like it. Okay, so now where's our next train? So we wanna get over here into our city. So let's actually start in the city and then we'll branch our way out. So I do want to, I do want to go under, get out of herbs. All right, so we need to go towards this train station. That actually kind of worked. I'm actually shocked. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shocked that it actually worked. Wow, guys. Okay, so we have that, and now, now we need to get it. How can we do this? I think I'm, I'm still gonna put it under. I can't put it underground. I think I have to raise it, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to raise the train from the depths of. <laughs> Oh my god, nobody, redo, nobody saw that, nobody saw that. Okay, we were doing a curved road, and we're going on an incline. There you go, not that high, but. 
There you go. And then go back to straight. Because now what we could do is we can connect space area occupied. Okay, if I had the move it tool, this would be the perfect opportunity to use it. But guess what? I don't have it. Well, I guess there goes our dream of putting it above ground. Sorry, guys. It, the highway is just too wide and I don't have the move it tool. So we're going to actually have to go underneath the metro. Great. That was going to look pretty cool. I'm going to be honest with you guys. That was going to look... I think that was going to look pretty cool. So we're going to go under here. I know, we need to go lower. We need to go below the metro line. Interesting. Maybe it's already pretty low. Hold on. Let's delete that one. Oh, it's already... Okay, so that metro line is actually really low off the ground. Okay. That makes sense. How can we do this without creating? See, now we don't want to completely jam up that line. So I think I'm going to do this. Can I, can I curve it? Curve it. Curve it, curve it, curve it. That works perfect. That is going to look that is going to be really good. Okay, I like that. I like that curve. I like everything about that. I like it a lot. Okay, so now we only have one more we need to connect up, and it shouldn't be too bad. Now, I do also have to create cargo transportation, but that we'll do that one step at a time. So this, I am... Uh, yeah, I definitely need to put this underground. So I'm going to put this all along here. I'm going to raise it up right there. I do want to curve this, though. So kind of run, do the same thing as I did with the other... Because you don't want to create very congested... Like, we don't want this main line to actually get insanely congested where none of our... You know where all the trains and pretty soon we're gonna have cargo so all the tra all the passenger tra trains and cargo will eventually have to you know we don't want them all to get bunched bottleneck together and so this is, is a nice way of doing it okay i do need to create this a little the i need to create it a little sooner okay come on And then we'll straighten that down below here. There you go. So we do have a couple more options later on, but I kind of like that design. I mean, that kind of works. That kind of, kind of, kind of works. All right. So what we need to do is connect the train lines up and we do have a metro underneath. So uh, the very first line we'll do, well, this is like our California coastline that we're going all the way down here and all the way over here. And remember, this will eventually get filled in. So don't freak out if you're, you know, if it looks kind of naked where it is because it's off on its own. Also, we know that the the platform itself we will fill in we'll fill it in also so don't worry about seeing that either so hopefully this helps alleviate some of the traffic i'm really banking on um the one to the left is the easiest one yeah right over here so this is how you build the trains and train hub it should work out really well we do want to finish connecting all these up now, I do have multiple stops on this one, so this might, hopefully this is the most popular line. And then we'll actually have it connect back. So remember also to double back your, um, you know, if you have multiple lines, make sure you go back on, like right here, we have two different lines. So we have one going to the right and one going to the left. 
So, you know, so passengers aren't waiting forever just for that one line. So we have everything connected. Now I do want to create the metro that's underneath. I do want to connect it. So where? Okay, so our metro, okay. So our metro actually goes from here to there. So I don't know how necessary this is going to be, but who knows? We're going to, we're going to try this one. Oh, that's a police station, so I can't actually take that down yet. Okay. We'll put that right there. So let's try to go. <laughs> we need to put the metro underground, which is kind of ironic because most of the time it is underground already. All right, so that connects to there. Oh, and I completely screwed that up, but that's all right. Now this is kind of funny because we do have a train. Oh no, wait, we did not connect our train to there. Okay, so that works. Okay, I was thinking that we actually had a train line connected there, but we don't. I mean, we could if we wanted to, but I just will have them use the Metro and I, I really don't see a point in doing that. So we're gonna create a line that goes here, here. We'll have it connect here. We'll just have it go through the city center essentially. And I did add a couple more train stations. That should be good. Can I complete the loop around? That is the question. I'm not sure. Ugh. No, I think I might have to get rid of that last one I made. No, let's just go reverse it then. Okay, we'll just have it go back. There you go. So I'm doubling back, so it just goes literally forward and back, and there's no loop. There's that. There's that, and then complete the loop. There you go. All right, I know that looks a little weird, but I, I didn't want it to go completely out of the city, the loop, because I technically, it's not a complete loop, if that makes sense. So the, that makes no sense. I just literally... In no sense. Um, what I'm saying is the train line is not a, an actual, the city train, the city metro line is not a real actual loop. So it's not like a full circuit. So that's why I didn't, I didn't actually make it a circuit, which actually makes a lot of sense. Interesting. And there's that. Now I do want to create train lines that actually come to here also. So, I mean, we did build the train line and we do want people to use it, correct? I mean, that is that is my thinking on all this. We do want people to actually use the train. Now I do know the Metro, in my mind, the Metro always seems like a better option. I don't know if you've ever gone to New York City. Maybe that's not the best option in the world, but you know, it is what it is. Now we have, where's our other train station? So we have one. So we want one right here. And we'll connect that up. It doesn't need to be a very big bus line. I mean, it just needs to be connected. Oh, no. Oh, God. There you go. And then the last one we'll do, the last couple are over here. Guys in the comment section below, uh, why didn't you guys remind me about bus lines? Now, I know I did add some bus lines, so that's besides the point, but oh my god, my transportation is like, seriously slacking, oh my gosh. We'll put one next to the metro, and then we'll complete the line. Over here, we're gonna do kind of the same thing. We're gonna use, we want this neighborhood to completely take over and use this whole, use use the train. I, I know the Metro is nearby, but we want them to use the train realistically also. Now in, when you're building trains in your, in your city, trains carry the most capacity compared to Metro. They, they take, they take more, handle more passengers essentially that's what i'm trying to say so that's just something to keep in mind but and the only other one is 
probably over here and there's already a bus stop over there so that's perfect but as you can tell this is our train station and well that's not our train oh and our train station needs power i was gonna say whoa we had whoa see look at they're all going off at one wow that looked cool that looked very cool all right the, now just remember this will be a temporary power line so don't We'll eventually be deleting them because they do look ugly and i am fully aware that they look ugly so just letting you know oh come on it's literally over the line like <sighs> so annoying that is so annoying six kinds i love this game but that was just that was just flat out annoying Oop, wrong thing There's that, and then we'll just put a little, put a little power line right there. I know, I know, I've got it. Oh, oh, here it is. All right, so that is it for today. I we are gonna fill in our look at this. This looks fantastic. 